in this video, we will be seeing how do we add a new item through the settings module. To access the settings module, we need to click on the nine dots on the top right corner of the screen and select settings. Inside the settings module, there is a catalog option from which we need to select the item section. Inside the item section, we need to click on the plus symbol and select items. So right now we will add the details of the product here. We can also add the description for the product here. Next, we will select the nature of the item. In case it is a pre-packed product, it is a goods item. In case it is an item that is being prepared at the outlet, it is a service item. We can also add a schedule for this item. In case this item is only available for breakfast, we can select the breakfast schedule. In case it is a lunch item, we can select the lunch option. Next, we can also add an image by selecting the image here. So we can add the channel specific images here by clicking on the plus symbol and selecting the image that has already been uploaded in the system. Or we can also select a new image from the system. Next, we can add the taxes. So we just need to tick mark on the right taxes. We can also add the option set that is the variant options. Next, we will select the category or the subcategory. Next, we will select the type of account, whether it is a food or a beverage account. So this we have an option of adding the tags so we can add the tags of veg non-veg spicy gluten free we can also add packaging charges here or any kind of service charges by selecting the charges option measuring unit also can be defined here it can either be portion kilo grams, liters, ml or pieces. And finally, we will add the selling price by clicking on the selling price option. So here we can add the selling price for multiple channels in one go itself. Right now we have added the prices for the multiple channels that this item will be available in. We will just check the prices. In case we need to override these prices, we can tick mark on the override option. In case these prices include taxes, we can check on the include tax option. Right now we have added all the details. We will click on back and we will save this item. So as you can see, a new item has been created successfully.